In this video, I'll show you how to operate the AM-FM tuner built into your new Pioneer DEHS 1200 UB. So, the AM-FM tuner or the radio is very easy to operate. We're going to get there by pressing the source button over here. So this takes us over to the auxiliary input. It might also take us to CD if we have a CD in the slot. Press that again and that takes us back around to uh, the AM FM radio. So there's a lot of information displayed on the screen here and we can change the type of information that is being displayed. Uh, so right now we're on FM uh, band number one. We're on radio station preset number three and the frequency is over here 89.3. So to tune in a different radio station, I'm going to use these track buttons right here. If I touch the arrow up, I go from 89.3 to 89.5. So that's the next available frequency up. Touch it again, takes me up to 89.7. If I touch back down the other way, it goes back down one frequency increment to 89.5 and to 89.3. If I want to seek to the next available radio station, press and, press and hold for a moment and then let go, and that will seek to the next strong radio station. Press and hold, let go, and that seeks to a strong radio station. So to create a radio station preset, I'm just going to tune in my favorite radio station here. We'll seek to the next radio station. And I'm going to press and hold, for example, button number four here. We'll press and hold for a moment. When that four stops flashing on the screen, we've locked in 102.5 as radio station preset number four on FM band number one. So FM band number one gives us six radio station presets to work with. If I touch the band button over here or the arrow back button, FM one here changes to FM number two, and that gives me six more radio stations. That's 12. Press it again. That changes to FM three for a total of 18 FM radio station presets available. Touch that one more time, and that jumps over to AM, where I have six AM radio stations available. And the same functions work here. Uh, touch the arrow up once to uh, find the next available frequency. Press and hold to seek to the next strong radio station. And of course, press and hold any of these buttons to create a radio station preset using your AM tuner. Touch the um, band button over here one more time, and we go back around to that original FM band number one. Now, there are a couple of other functions that are built into the system. Let's take a look at those as well. When I'm on the FM radio, AM FM radio source, press in on the volume control, and I want to scroll along here until I find the function menu. So these are the functions inside the AM FM radio. We'll press uh, in on the volume control, and I have three different functions available here. BSM, or best station memory. I also have the local seek settings. We'll show you how that works. And I also have the seek type manual or preset channel. So let's start off with BSM, or best station memory, and right now we're on FM band number one. So if I press in on the volume control, BSM or best station memory will scan the entire FM spectrum and lock in the six strongest radio stations that you're receiving right now into your FM band number one radio station presets. So you're driving along, the radio stations become weak, use that BSM function to find six strong radio stations. You can see as I touch them here, you'll see six strong radio stations available. And of course, this is based on the radio broadcasts in your area at any given time while you're moving in your vehicle. Let's go back into that function menu. And press enter there. And roll along to the next setting, which is our local seek setting. Right now you can see that local is switched off. If we press in on the volume control, we can switch local on. There it's designated on now. Touch it again, that'll change to level 2, level 3, or level 4. Touch it one more time, and the local uh, is switched off. Now, local is a filter to filter out the weaker radio stations. So if you want to filter out the weakest radio stations, every noise on the dial, switch uh, local on to level number 1. And that will filter out some of the weakest radio stations as you seek from one radio station to the next. So let's try that out. We'll go back out to our... Um, out to the AM FM tuner and now when we seek to a radio station it'll skip past the weakest radio stations and only tune in some of the stronger ones because we have the local setting on. Let's go back into our function menu and if I uh, change uh, the lo local level up to for example level 4 its highest level or the strongest filter and we go back out now 
Now, when I hit my uh, seek function, it'll only stop on the very strongest radio stations on the dial. And in this case, you can see that was the only one that it found with the local setting set up to number four. So I'm going to change that again. Let's change the local setting to two. That filters out some of the weakest, uh, noisiest radio stations, but it still lets me tune in the strongest ones. So let's go back now to our function menu and we'll roll over to the seek type. So the seek setting is right now it's set to manual. If I press in on the volume control, I can also have the seek set to the preset channels. So for right now, we'll set it up as preset channels. And let's go back out to the AM FM tuner function. Here we're on FM band one. I can choose my radio station presets by touching the buttons here. But since I've set up the seek to preset, if I hit the arrow up, that goes through my radio station presets. We're on preset four, hit arrow up, that's preset five, hit arrow up again, that's preset six, hit arrow up one more time, that is back around to preset number one. Now, if I want this to work as a seek function and choose between uh, radio stations that are not in my presets, change that to manual. So let's go back into the settings menu, the function menu, and change seek to manual setting. When it's on its manual setting, we'll go back out here. And now when I use this, it will allow me to adjust the radio station individually, or of course, seek to the next available uh, radio strong radio station. Once you're done making your adjustments with the radio stations, you can change the information that's displayed on the screen right here with the D or the display button. We can have the clock displayed. We can have broadcast information displayed. If the radio station is broadcasting some text, you'll see that on the screen. And you can have the radio frequency. For right now, I'm going to change mine to the clock, where I still get to see we're on FM band number one, and I get the clock. And of course, we have the signal strength indicator across the top.